Hello everyone. It's time to ask yourself what to play in October 2022. Let's see what October has in store for us. Also, if this is your first time on our channel and you really liked our selection, then subscribe, press finger up and enjoy. Let's go. Legacy of Thieves Collection Just follow the sound of gunfire The Legacy of Thieves Collection is coming to PC on October 19, 2022. Earlier this year, PlayStation and Naughty Dog released the Legacy of Thieves Collection, which includes remastered versions of Uncharted 4. A Thief's End and Uncharted. The Lost Legacy for PlayStation 5. While it was known that this collection would also be coming to PC in the future, an exact release date has not been announced that is now changed. According to the Epic Games Store, Uncharted. Legacy of Thieves Collection will finally release on PC this month on October 19, 2022. Uncharted. Legacy of Thieves Collection is a remaster of Uncharted 4 and the Lost Legacy standalone expansion for PS5 and PC. No. I like the hand we've been dealt. Get up here! The game follows the latest adventure of Nathan Drake as he hunts for Captain Avery's long-lost treasure. The protagonist tried to return to normal life when his older brother Sam, who had been considered dead all these years, suddenly showed up. He needs Drake's help. Together they will go on a trip around the world in search of the legendary pirate treasures. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. Take the wheel! Watch the out of your mind! Probably! Oh, crap, crap, crap! The Lost Legacy will move the setting to India. The main characters are Nadine Ross and Chloe Frazier, known from previous games in the Uncharted series. They have to go to India to conquer the city of Bangladesh in search of the legendary treasure. How long we been chasing this thing, huh? You and me. Did you miss the hero theme? That and this October saved for you. Gotham Knights If you're watching this, I'm dead. This is a cold black. Release date October 21st, 2022 Windows, PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series XS Gotham Knights is an open-world action game that tells the story of Batman's four allied heroes. Robin, Batgirl, Nightwing, and Red Hood. The game has a single, offline, and cooperative mode for two players, and the latter works on the principle of drop-in drop-out, that is, you can enter exit the session at any time. Also, you are not tied to each other and can explore the city, being in completely different parts of the map. In co-op, you can choose the same characters, say, two Robins. The plot will unfold in a slightly alternative universe where Batman died and launched the so-called Nightfall Protocol. However, all sorts of theories are already being put forward that the Dark Avenger is still alive, and the plot will be much deeper, especially given the appearance of the Court of Owls. Regardless of whether Batman is alive or not, you have to control one of the four characters of the Bat family Nightwing, Batgirl, Robin and Red Hood, uses non-lethal weapons. At the same time, you can go through the whole game for one, for example, if you liked Robin or Batwoman. The world of Gotham Knights is open, unlimited, and divided into five regions. At the same time, according to the developers, we will get the most dynamic, lively and interactive Gotham City, perhaps a comparison with the Arkham series was meant here. As we were shown in the video, you can move around the city using a standard grappling hook or on a vehicle, in particular on a bat cycle. Robin can also use the Justice League teleporter.
Not a whisper word is said. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Release date, October 28, 2022, PC, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series XS, Call of Duty. Modern Warfare 2 is the sequel to the popular first-person shooter adventure series in the Call of Duty series. The game is a direct continuation of Modern Warfare 2019. The events of the story campaign will unfold three years after the end of the first part. The game will tell about the struggle of the Operational Tactical Group 141 with the Mexican drug cartel and the terrorist group Al Catala. In story missions you will be able to visit Mexico, the USA and the countries of Europe and Asia. Infinity Ward boasted the achievements of the still unreleased first person shooter Call of Duty. Modern Warfare 2. It has been revealed that the recent beta has proven to be the most popular in the history of the franchise. The largest number of people took part in testing, who in total played more matches and hours. The Plague Tale Requiem Release date October 18, 2022, PC, PlayStation 5, Xbox Series XS, Nintendo Switch, the sequel takes place a few months after the end of A Plague Tale. Innocence. Amisha, along with her brother Hugo, mother Beatrice and the alchemist Luca, head to the south of France to places that have not been affected by the Rat Plague. The heroes manage to live a quiet life quite a bit until the little brother begins to have strange dreams about a mysterious island. One day, the disease of his kind, Makula, awakens in the boy's blood again, and the heroes decide to find the very place from Hugo's nightmares, in the hope that the island will provide answers to all questions. Players will be able to choose the style of passage to their liking. Amisha uses strength, agility, and various weapons, such as a crossbow or incendiary projectiles, to eliminate enemies both silently and in open combat. Hugo's connection with rats has noticeably increased he can feel the blood of enemies at a distance and can control a huge crowd of rodents. But the use of such power carries dire consequences. It's... the rats. This world hurts. Overwatch 2. Overwatch 2 free-to-play launches on October 4, and now we're sharing details about the plan changes. Overwatch 2 will receive regular seasonal updates, as well as a battle pass with new content, including new heroes, game modes, battlegrounds, decorative items and more. Overwatch is originally a social game that has always been most fun to play together. Thanks to the free model, all players anywhere in the world will be able to start the game with friends or find friends online. Along with the transition to the free model, a new shared progress feature has also been added, making it easy to play on any platform while maintaining progress and accessing public content.
Season 1 introduces Sojourn, the Vulture Queen, and a support hero we haven't seen yet, as well as new 5v5 PvP combat, updated heroes, new battlegrounds, modes, and more. We also released a redesigned competitive mode that will open up more opportunities for players to improve their gamma play and create a sense of progress. With a move to 5v5 battles, players will be able to have more influence over the course of matches, and additional systems will also appear in the game to help you evaluate your contribution to the results of each match. Null sector invasion. Winston, clear as a spot to land. We'll be right behind you. You better be. Already on October 4th, along with the start of early access, the first season will begin, which includes three new heroes, six new cards, new modes, more than 30 new skins, and one mythical skin. And two months later, on December 6th, the second season will begin. With him in the game will appear. New tank hero, new map, more than 30 new skins, first battle pass. About six seasons are waiting for fans a year. At the same time, each time they promise as many as several game events, and every two seasons one new character. Uh, un singe? Resident Evil Village. Gold Edition. Releases October 28, 2022 for PC, PS4, PS5, Xbox One, and Xbox Series XS. The expansion takes place 16 years after the Resident Evil Village finale. Players will assume the role of Rose Winters, the grown-up daughter of Ethan Winters, who is trying to rid herself of terrifying supernatural powers. To do this, she will have to penetrate the mind of the Megamycelium, explore a surreal world in which familiar locations and characters appear in an altered form, and find a cure. Hardly worth the effort. Let's wrap this up quickly. The screenshots, which are also in the trailer, show a snippet of the scene in which Rose meets her copy, and a snippet of the boss fight, which looks like the Merchant Duke, the Duke. The heroine will be directed by the mysterious assistant Michael. Shadows of Rose will be available on October 28 as part of the Winter's Expansion expansion. The latter will be part of the Resident Evil Village Gold Edition, and will also offer new locations and characters for the Mercenaries mode, and the ability to switch to a third-person view in the main game. On the same day, the multiplayer action re. Verse starts, which will be free for all owners of the 8th part.
And if you really liked our video, then subscribe, press the finger up. And most importantly, play only good games. Thanks to all. Good luck.